Hi everyone, I'm meteorologist Station Knight. Your Wednesday weather started off on a cold note, but getting into the afternoon, I think we're looking at a five star afternoon. We will have sunshine today. We'll have light winds at most, probably a wind speed about five to seven miles per hour and temperatures in the low to mid 60s. Near normal, a beautiful, beautiful day. Take your sunglasses with you and if you'll be spending quite a bit out time of time outdoors today, say headed to the park with the kiddos who are out on spring break. Don't forget sunscreen. Now this evening and overnight, we will have cloud cover increase and there's a small potential for maybe a brief shower and a rumble of thunder tomorrow morning, but it is a low chance, less than 10%, so you're not going to see it on the seven day planner. Overall, things will be pretty quiet and overnight into tomorrow again. We will have the partly to mostly cloudy skies. Temperatures will be in the low to mid 40s. We will have a stronger south breeze tomorrow, increasing dew points. And then with the humidity values just a touch higher, it's not going to be enough to combat the fire danger. Tomorrow, fire risk will be high. And so the warmer temperatures, the stronger winds, the fire spread rate will be over 150 feet per minute. So we'll have to be careful. Today, the fire risk is low. Tomorrow, we're expecting highs in the low to mid 70s. When we get cloud cover in the afternoon, or most of it should be just off to our east. So you'll be a little bit cooler for our far eastern counties in the metro mid 70s and mid 70s just west of the metro as well. Getting into the weekend, we'll have an opportunity for maybe a few showers and a rumble of thunder in our far eastern counties on Saturday morning, but it will be Sunday that the start of an active pattern sets up. We'll have a chance for some scattered showers and storms on Sunday. We'll continue that into Monday, and then when surface features move in, a cold front and a surface low, we're going to increase our chances for some heavier rainfall on Tuesday. Now, this will be a slow-moving system, so it'll be moving in early Tuesday, could potentially not move out until early Wednesday, uh, and this will be an, also an active pattern with some upper-level energy that slides by just pretty much uh, energy after energy after energy. So next week is going to be an active week. Until then, enjoy the rest of your quiet and warm spring break with highs in the 70s Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and then the rain chances for next week. For the latest weather updates, be sure to text 6Connect to 79640.